What's up everyone, today I'm back with another video, and on this video I'm going to be obtaining the third version of the mink race in block street so i'm going to be obtaining mink version 3. now there is a little bit of stuff that you need to do to obtain mink version 3 uh by the time you're going to see this video you'll see me publish my mink version 2 video so it's going to come after it and uh, maybe even the hea raid video you'll probably see that first before i upload this um next part of the mink um race upgrades uh, but that's about it. So that's gonna be today's focus of the video. Uh, if you guys do like the content and enjoy it Please do like and subscribe as it really helps me out a lot currently I'm trying to hit 450 subs and then we're gonna aim for the 500 to get the community gap. So that guys Yeah, let's get in the intro. I'll see you there guys all right so we're now done and we can start doing our quest now there is a couple of tasks as i've said to the mink uh, version 3 now to get mink version 3 we'll need to take aroe's quest arrows aroe aroe so i'll say aroe so aroe is found in a hidden room under diamond's hill so we're gonna have to go to diamond and we're gonna be looking for him so we're gonna have to go to diamond's mountain so yeah let's just make our way real quick towards this place it's right around here conveniently and we'll see where is the entrance apparently it's located at the back so we'll probably just have to go to the back location all right so if you actually go All right, so if you actually go right over here to the side, so you're gonna have to face the tree exactly backwards. I see this like tiny flower at the edge here, which kind of has the yellow parts passing through. So if you actually go right here, you can notice a tiny different texture. And when you go inside here, again, I'm just gonna show the location. So this is how it looks like. When you go inside, you will be able to enter into a railway's um, hidden room. So now we should be able to speak to him and he can give us a quest. So, greetings, sir. Let's begin. But I am Aro, a son am Aro, a son of R.I.P. Indra. I trained those less fortunate. Then I too challenge. I too <laughs> channel their hidden strengths. Oh my god, hidden strengths. Yes, child. I know this might be confusing for you, but I have been sent here by the gods to teach those who seek my wisdom in order to make their race ability stronger. I'm interested. Excellent. Talk to me again once you pick up 30 treasure chests. So, this is going to be the first part of the quest. You're going to need to take 30 chests across the map, and then we'll have to go back to him in the... Speak to him once we found these uh, 30 chests, so I'm uh, gonna have to start working on that one, you know, it's 30 chests. So, uh, I'm just gonna begin off, and I'm probably gonna do like a speed cut of this, showcasing every location I can get. So this is chest number one, it, it should be pretty easy, pretty easy, um, around this place specifically because Dress Rosa is packed with chests, like everywhere you go in this place, it, it, it's like it's like it's have a chest. This was like four chests already. Yeah, okay, see another one. So that's five chests. Actually, I might not even have to skip cut this, you know, we you know, I'll just keep it like this. So that was like six chests. Oh, see a seven one. Yeah, Dr Dress Rosa is just really like the easiest way to get this quest done. Um I yeah, I believe if you go right over to the side of the Swan Pirates, that is the eighth chest. Uh, there's no one year Sabo from what I'm aware of, so we're not actually gonna need to go there.
Alright, so now I think I got around enough of 30 chests. I don't think I need more. I got a bunch of them. Uh, like right around here, right? Yeah, okay, so right around here again. I'm just gonna show you this. You see diamond, just a little to the side of diamond. And uh, let's go if we can speak to Arrow, to Arrox, to Arrow. Arrow, yeah, my god, I keep forgetting this. Well done, I like many toads before me, have used- Oh, well done, I like- I, like many toads before me, have used this gift of mine to teach others. Of course, though, I charge a cheap price for my craft. Two million should do it. Crazy bastard. <laughs> and there we go. Excellent. Your race has evolved. Godspeed. Oh, yeah, we got the agility moves. So, if you actually don't know, Mink Free Free has a secret- I mean, it's not really a secret move, but- it's a new move that you can obtain. So basically, oh, also I forgot to mention there is a couple of requirements as I'm doing this. So the first requirement is to have two million cash. The second one is having any sort of race, like the race that you're trying to awaken to V3. You need to have already have it at V2. And you need to feed Doflamingo one, which is Dawn Swan. To defeat Dawn Swan, you need one million Devil Fruit, which costs like one million value or above, and you trade it to um to the person in the mansion. And trouble, 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 trouble. I think something like that. Trouble, like I think that's her name. You trade it to her, and she gives you access to fight Del Flamingo. So you have to beat him, and then you have access. So regarding Mink Free, uh, here is the stats. So it also gives you a cute little rabbit, uh, rab <laughs> rabbit. Oh my god, rabbit tail. Um, which is just a cool cos cosmetic that you can kind of have. It kind of also moves around, which is really cool, along with the bunny ears. Uh, but this is what it does. So it unlocks you an ability when you activate it, the player's movement speed will increase four times their normal speed, and it increases the player's dash length slightly. So the agility lasts for 6.5 seconds and has a cooldown of 30 seconds. So let's just test this out. Yeah, I can feel a lot faster, I think. Just genuinely. I can feel a lot faster. Now let's try and activate agility. So as you can see, this gives us like this green aura. Yo, look at how fast that Yo, <laughs> look at this. So it gives you like these green, um, it's like kind of circle spirals around you. You just like dash, you zoom in. And it's super awesome. So that's it on how you can obtain Mink version free. I hope you guys have really enjoyed this video. Uh, before I actually finish it off though, I'm actually going to see a test run of how quickly can I get through the bridge. So we now have the ability again, it kind of just reset it, so 
Three, two, one, go. Oh, 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 I'm speed, bro. Yeah, so we literally dashed that in seconds. That is super awesome. So that's how you get Ming V free, guys. I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you want more of these type of videos for other races as well that I can unlock, uh, just suggest them down below in the comments, and I'll read through it and see what I can do. I was once suggested the cyborg stuff. I'm probably going to say that for later uh, because it does seem like it has some special requirements to even obtain the normal one. Uh, but with that, guys, I'm ending the video. So thank you so much for watching, and cue the outro. See you in the next video, guys. Thank you for watching.